Yeah. Morning glory. Yeah. Waking up to beautiful view. Sun. There was sun. Yeah. Some time ago. Yeah. yeah. When did you wake up? Uh, first time. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I stood up one hour ago. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so it's nine now? Yeah. Yeah. Just before eight. <clears throat> and there was fog on the road, like this. Oi! Reindeer. Yeah. Is that it? Mm -hmm. There was fog on the road, like this mystic fog. Yeah. And then the sun came out and all the fog disappeared and this lake just woke up. Yeah. I think best part about Land Rover and the Range Rover yeah. drop down tailgate with the roof. Yeah. It's just perfect. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I slept well. Yeah, I woke up two o'clock. It was way too warm. Okay. Yeah. I took everything off, uh, just boxer shorts. Yeah. And slept through until five. Then it was just a bit chilly, so I took on the hood. Yeah. The sleeping bag hood. Turned yeah. Tighten it in, and then I woke six because the sun came out. And seven, I woke again. <laughs> <laughs> That's tent living. Because <laughs> you have all the light. Yeah, it was really comfortable. Not freezing. Not a bad back. Okay. Yeah, I, I need to move around. Yeah. I notice I need to. Uh, it's not that soft. Uh, so I. I uh, now and again I need to move around. Lay on the side. Lay on my back. And, yeah. Yeah. Got slipped well. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Time to uh, get some coffee yes. and uh, some breakfast. Yips. Waking up, the rain there is coming down the road. It's just crazy. I think it's the most epic morning <coughs> we have ever had. I think uh, this doesn't happen. No. no. <laughs>
It's just, I'm sitting here in my sleeping <laughs> bag on the rear of my Discovery and then a uh, bunch of uh, reindeer is coming down. How many? Six. This is what I wish uh, my kids were here yeah. with me, seeing this experience. All the thing missing is the morning coffee. Yeah, I'm waiting for you. Yeah. Here's the cooking setup for today, the old primus and yeah, making bacon and eggs in this, boiling water in this for coffee, simple but uh, great setup. Opening the gas and match. Fire! <laughs> Oil water first. Then we will see if this is faster than the, the jet boil. I don't think so. Again, water is ready. Coffee in the morning. Perfect size. Let that brew for a bit. And as always, Eric. Get your. I'm ready. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I need to find my cup. I have two cups. <laughs> <laughs> You're really ready. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, yep. Some more. Take your own bacon, then we can uh the coffee, I think. Sound effects. <laughs> With sound effects. <laughs> Hashtag not done in the edit room. <laughs> <laughs> That's the juice. Mm. That's good. Oh, look. 
looking forward to this. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, today as well, coffee is better outside. Cheers. Un botella. Yeah. Don't mess this up. <laughs> oh, go in. Uh, it's not the biggest deal. practice my egg cracking skills. No top chef for, for me. <laughs> <laughs> but at least I don't have to cook. Yeah, scramble or just... Uh, uh, doesn't matter. Okay. As it happens to turn out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Three eggs may be too much for this pan, but... Uh, uh, I think maybe scramble is the way to go. Yeah, yeah. probably. Small pans there, they're so thin, so there's uh, kind of an uneven cooking. So, uh, yeah. you think it's done? Mm, yeah. yeah, good. Polar bread with bacon and scrambled eggs. Not the worst breakfast. I think that's about half. Yeah, perfect. Bon appetit. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Scored. Can we say, Varsågod. Huh? Can we say, Varsågod. Yeah, Varsågod. Was it good? Mm. Mm. Yes, so we all packed up and we have moved our cars because we don't want it to be in the way. We are going to head up into the mountains for a hike for the, I guess the first time for a Land Rover drive. We can go and see how that, that goes. <laughs> five hundred, five, five hundred meters, three hundred meters. We are already sweating, so uh, <laughs> already a workout. Shotgun shell or the inside. So the powder sits there and the small pellet bullet sits in here. And this flies out, so 
If you no, see them, that's pure plastic. This is just pure plastic. So if you see them, pick them up, clean up. <laughs> Amazing view. Mountains there are just epic. And it's like this through all of the uh, Jotunheimen. So uh, if you go here, just Enjoy the views and take a moment to stop and hit the trails. Er det to meter, eller? Ja. Fikk ingen med hoppet en gang. Fikk ingen med hoppet. Oi! Almost on the top, up there. Best of team? I don't know. Uh, it's five minutes and we, since, since we checked name, yes. <laughs> 1249 meters above sea level or something. Best run Tella. Best run mountain, uh, 1224. Okay. You have reached the summit. Maybe not the biggest one when we look around there. And there's <laughs> one, two, three, four. No, we are not gonna. Yeah, so every summit around us is bigger, but uh, gotta start somewhere. Uh, we don't have skis or so. No shoes. Yeah, it gives us the limitation. Yeah, but uh... well, we started 11 o'clock something. Yeah. So a bit more than one hour. From the lake. Yep. So lunch is going to be up here. You notice one thing? Huh? You notice one thing? Huh? No wind? No wind. <laughs> yeah. It's a bit weird. Yeah. So Usually you are freezing when you come to the top and seeking to go down. Yeah, I'm sweating. <laughs> so the cars are on that side, which we can see. And uh, yeah. But we saw when we, on the map, when we came up here, we can see around the other area. So yeah. It's nice. That's the way down, isn't it? Yeah. You can see the road going down the valley. So yesterday we was on that lake looking for a camp. Yeah, small one. Yeah, uh, on both. Yeah, no, that one there, isn't it? Yeah, it would have been amazing. Also, you can see the other place we were. It's over there. So we went on that one, both sides, looking for, for, for camp. We ended up 
on this big lake. On that one. Yep. So probably can see all the way down to Dovre Mountain, maybe. Uh, maybe yeah. those big ones. I can check on the map. Yeah, so uh, the the big but, ones in the far end is Dovre. Yeah, because this this mountain group is going this way, and the Dovre mountain group is going the other way. Yeah. And we will have the Rondane on on that far side. Yeah. To the east. Yeah, I guess uh, if you look, no, no, if you see it uh, uh, just on the top there, behind there, that's mm. Rondane. Yeah. Um, oh, let's see if you see. Uh, where's Skalipping? Should be. Should yeah, be this that, way. Yeah, that way. Yeah. It's a big one in the in the fog there, isn't it? Let's see, Skalipping is behind. Yeah, so that's the tallest mountain in Norway, if you didn't know, 2,469 meters above sea level. Tobias Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which is a thousand meter more. That's 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 high up. Yeah, that's really high. Yeah, lunch, 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 yeah, lunch. Okay, quick lunch, and we are done. Heading back down and uh, yeah, starting to drive. And we are going to drive to Tulum. Tulum. Or almost. Almost Tulum. Now we're going to drive down uh, this valley, just make a U turn on the other side of the mountains here, and then start south again and head to uh, against Brumedarn. Yeah. Down. <laughs> I overdid them there. <laughs> yeah. I have to come back next year. Yep. Or later. Kind of a nice walk for, uh, for kids. Not too far, not too steep. The views were really good. Like, if the uh, weather is clear, you can see Gullipi and I guess thing, and uh, yeah. Speed is the key. <laughs> <laughs> Another one. Not too old. I guess they are hunting Rippe. Uh, I'm not sure what that's called. Kind of a bird that yeah. lives on the ground. We haven't seen anyone, so there's a uh... bird. We were just discussing why we didn't take this path <laughs> up. It's gonna be a quick descent. <laughs> Not bad for a Brumen darling. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> we are down from mountain. I'm gonna change some clothes because it's starting to, uh, to smell a bit. And yeah, sweating all the way. Let's see. And I got some new. New stuff here. Let's see. Whoop whoop. 
Another drive over down in Norway. Yep. New t-shirts. That was my mystery pickup uh, before I left for the Brumendalen. So I was going to change socks, shoes, uh, uh, yeah. Then we're going to start uh, driving. Cool. <laughs> New t-shirts. Let me know if you want one. Uh, comment down below. Yeah. Thinking of making some merch, uh, so uh, let me know and I will try and make that happen. Feels good this one. Yeah. Nice. I think it's 100% cotton. So it's soft and good. Uh, yep. Need some... What do I need? New, new socks. Be sure to like and subscribe and check out Patreon if you want to help me create more overlanding in Norway content. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Good morning. Just woken up. I can see that uh, Eric has uh, woken up. Look at the views outside.